I'm Sarah from The Upcoming. So lovely to meet you. So what's so special about the story of The Little Drummer Girl? First of all, it was written 40 years ago, and it's as topical today as it was then, even more so. Uh, the whole issue of Israel-Palestine is a hotter one than ever. Anti-Semitism in Britain particularly is a very hot subject, as it is indeed in Europe now. So uh, we, we walked into an extraordinarily topical theme. And it was very clever, I think, of my sons, who are the producers, not to go for a bang, bang, bang after the night manager, but to go for something thinky and deeper and, and uh, altogether unexpected. An incredible cast and director, not least with Florence Pugh right at the centre of it. How is it to have that? An annoying girl there is always getting in my way, but, <laughs> but apart from her, it's great. <laughs> it's a, so now a wonderful cast, and she gives an unbelievably good performance. It's, I think, however great she is later, this will be, as far as I'm concerned, the performance of her life. Yeah. It is hugely exciting. This is a small screen, really. We're seeing a lot of this bigger screen. This yeah, it's hugely exciting. And I think it's so topical, and so unlikely that we, you know, a book from 40 years ago has got a new life now. For me, it's thrilling. Uh, but also, the relevance of it is wonderful. And we're led by a very strong woman in the Me Too era. A woman who's been manipulate, manipulated by a, bunch of, by a bunch of clever men, and it fits very well. Yes. I, then I want it to become. I want it to become the film of the film, not the film of the book. I want him to take it over. I want to get out of life, get out of his way, which is what I do.